everyone, it's Stephanie. Welcome back to my channel. I feel like I have been hearing myself talk non-stop today because I've been filming since 10 a.m. and it's now 1.30 in the afternoon. It's Sunday. I'm starting a new vlog, a weekly vlog. I have filmed um, like three videos. I'm about to do try-on stuff right now and do some TikToks in between with the try-on. So that is what we're doing. I, my room is a disaster. When I film any room I'm in, instant disaster. So Love that. The shirt I'm wearing is from Shein like last year. It's like a red velvet holiday shirt. I feel like my hair looks like really long today. Love that. We're growing it out. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and start fin finishing filming the Shein try on haul so I can get these videos edited tonight because I do have to send a video over for review. So we got a lot of stuff to do. Let's do this. Hi guys. So it is... 3.30, it's Sunday afternoon. I just finished filming, doing everything that needed to be filmed, recorded, photos, all that, etc. And um, now I am heading over to the donation like drop-off. We got rid of two, one ginormous uh, garbage bag full of clothes that I'm just gonna donate. I'm gonna go drop those off now because before I forget, cause I will forget and then they'll sit in my um, hallway and then I never will drop them off. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to drop them off and yeah. So I also like will occasionally add stuff over on my Poshmark. So my Poshmark is always listed down below in the description box. So if you guys want to check it out, it's there. I try to clean out my closet because I've just had like an influx of packages come in and I just need to get rid of stuff that I don't wear. It doesn't bring me joy anymore. It doesn't fit me anymore. I don't know about you guys, but one thing about being like fluctuating in my weight for the past three years now, I've been going up and down and I'm a little bit on the upside right now and and I just like a lot of my clothes that were fitting me are not fitting me anymore. So it's just like I don't need to hold on to these clothes that don't fit me. It's just honestly, it's it's ridiculous how much stuff I have that it doesn't even fit me anymore. A lot of stuff I have to do still. It's 3.30, but like with the time change, I just cannot function. Like I'm like the worst at it. I get nighttime anxiety really, really, really bad. Um, and when the time goes back, my nighttime anxiety, instead of it starting at like maybe 6.30, 7.30 p.m., it starts at four o'clock. So it's like, it's about that time where the sun's going down and I'm starting to be like, Bleh. so the short work week, I get a lot of work anxiety, you guys, um, but it's a short work week, so that is good. Anyways, Thursday's Thanksgiving, so that should be interesting. Um, yeah, let's go drop off these things. There's like a lot of people here in our room. So I wanted to talk to you guys about these two perfumes that I just got in the mail from Dossier, and I'm so excited because you guys know I am like a true Dossier fan. I absolutely love their luxury scented perfumes at a fraction of the price. Just to show you guys, these are the current three faves that I have right now, and they are like literally almost at their end of life because I've used them so much. You know someone in your life that is like a really big Perfume or cologne wear dossier is the best place to get some really good deals this holiday season So first one that I got is ambery vanilla, which is a dupe for the YSL black opium It is my favorite perfume. I love this one so much and it just it smells so good every time I wear this perfume I get so many compliments on it. So I highly recommend this one and then the second one that I got fruity almond Which is a dupe for the Carolina Herrera good girl perfume and I love this because each um, little bottle comes with detailed information on the exact perfume and this one smells so good so fresh it really does smell like the real carolina herrera this has nodes of almond peach orange blossom vanilla cocoa it's just such a good smelling like very luxurious very boss babe 
Oh, it smells so fresh. So I love their closures on all of their perfumes because they just like have like a magnetic closure. Really sleek, very minimal packaging detail. I love this like so much. It's just so, so nice. So I love these. I love getting luxury for a fraction of the price and you definitely get that with these. So there's cologne, perfume. You'll definitely find something for everyone in this holiday season. I will leave coupon codes and links to these perfumes down below in the description box if you guys want to check any of them out this holiday season. Um, I'm definitely going to be getting my brother some colognes for Christmas and I've gotten him the Creed dupe and it smelled so good he loved that one and I think this year we're gonna get him the Sauvage dupe because it smells so so good so anyways definitely check out Dossier and all your perfume needs will be met this season yesterday when I got my nails done and these are my nails so I know the lighting that I have right now is like a little bit harsh you can see like the glitter reflex in the light but depending on the light, like the glitter looks different. So you guys can see like the lighting here, it's a little bit different than the lighting here. It makes it really glittery. My nail lady is, she loves Disney like I do. She got these pair of ears and she was like, what do you think of these? And then she's like, you can have them. Um, and when she gave me these, she's like, these ears just look like you. Look at these mouse ears that she gave me. They were from Amazon, but it is the Shop Disney brand. Um, I can't find them anywhere online anymore, but she did get them on Amazon. They are like a leather with the studs. So let me put these on because they're so... <gasps> Look at these. Oh my gosh, you guys. Like the little chain detail. It's so cute. It's so me. Like I would throw on a leather jacket and rock these in the park. Like these are so, so cute. The chain is a little bit heavy on them. Like they're a little bit heavy, but the detail... These are so cute. So she gave me those. So I wanted to share those with you to edit a video that has to be sent over to a brand tomorrow. So we're going to go edit that. Um, this is the bag from my most recent Shein haul. I know I'm going to get questions. It's from Shein. You can get these on Amazon as well. But yeah. So anyways, that is what I am doing. I'm going to go take off this makeup. I'm actually going to take off my lashes right now. Hello friends. I feel like it's been a couple days since I've last vlogged because it has been um it is thanksgiving so happy thanksgiving to everybody i am currently um waiting for my mom to like finish up some things in the kitchen but i wanted to take a second and vlog a little bit i'm wearing a brown shirt you know keeping it festive but i have sweatpants on because we're not wearing regular clothes um and yeah i'm just really excited to eat so also the jonas brothers are performing the halftime at the dallas cowboys game today I'm so excited that they're doing halftime i'm pretty sure it's going to be a great show i'm going to go head downstairs and help my mom if she needs help with anything and get ready to eat because your girl's hungry Guys, so I am finished with Thanksgiving dinner. I watched the Jonas Brothers halftime and it was great. I enjoyed it so much. It makes me miss them being on tour. So I just, I hope they come on tour next year. So I wanted to take the time to unbox a handbag for you guys. I actually have two. Now this company sent me over two amazing quality bags. Brand, I will leave their information down below in the description box where you guys can um shop the website as well as contact them it will all be listed down below they're both gucci and i'm very very excited so let's go ahead and show you the first one first one it came in this gucci box so we're gonna go ahead and open this inside you get another little duster bag in the box which i love i keep the boxes and keep everything stored in there so this bag is a gucci wallet on chain bag so i have this bag in the large size and i wanted to go ahead and get it in the wallet on the chain so this one literally will only fit like a couple things in it it has a long chain strap on it it's so nice like the chain is super heavy super good quality um and then this is what it looks like um it's it's the I don't know how to pronounce the bag this is the inside of the bag as you guys can see it's very very small like you can only carry like a few things in here like this has like the little um, chain to add to hold your keys to like you can my iPhone doesn't even fit in here so like this is literally a small little like wallet on chain if I don't have a phone case on my iPhone then I could fit something in here but this is like something really really small if you're like going out somewhere and you don't want to carry like a ton of stuff but you still want like a little bag to hold like your lip gloss and then like your wallet and ID this is something that would be really great so let me show you guys the detail up close like this bag is so gorgeous the detailing like you can just really see the quality on this bag 
I love this. So I just like always kind of wear it like a satchel like this. I just would wear it down. Um, it's perfect. It's the perfect size. It's really, really good quality. I love this bag. And again, I always usually keep mine still stored in the dust bag. And the dust bag that it comes with is really nice as well. So the next bag that they sent me is in this bigger dust bag. And this is a tote bag, which is a tote bag that I really do like and also that my mom absolutely loves as well. So I'm sure we're going to be sharing this. So in the bag, you get like that little like receipt thing. It says Gucci. It's for both of the bags. Here is the other tote bag. So this is just like a big tote. It's very, very good for like travel or like every day. Like if you go to the office and stuff like that, it's really big. It came stuffed like this, which I love. So I usually keep the stuffing in there, but you guys can see the quality is just beautiful. Like I am obsessed with this bag. So there you get the Gucci and it's in that brown, dark brown material. This is the back. You have the two top handles. It is such a big and spacious bag like i have to back up a little bit so i could show you also with the bag you get the little like wristlet just looks like this it's like a little wristlet bag and like tie this into the bag so that it doesn't like then you get like a little like wristlet little like wallet clutch thing you can just hold on to this you can throw it in the bag i kind of leave mine always in the bag and that's what it looks like it's just really really good quality all the way around and what I like about their bags on their website is that they're all like at a really affordable price and they have two types of tiers of bags. They have like the more luxurious with the higher, higher quality bags, And then they have like another range of bags that are a little bit less pricey, but they aren't as top notch quality, but they're still really good quality. These bags are so good. If you know someone that's a luxury lover, but you don't want to spend the full price on luxury items for the holiday season, definitely check them out. I will leave their information listed down below in the description box. And you guys can shop both of the bags that I picked up in today's video. It is the end of the night. I am going to take off my makeup now. And I think I'm going to go maybe watch a movie with my mom or something. I don't know. But I want to get my lashes off because they've been bothering me. So... That's what we're doing. I also bit my tongue during Thanksgiving dinner today. I don't know what happened, but like now it's like, it really hurts. So that's that, tomorrow's Black Friday. I don't think I'm gonna go Black Friday shopping, but I might, I don't know. I'm torn because I do wanna get Christmas shopping done this weekend, but I'm gonna try to stick to just doing it online. I don't wanna go to the store. Um, so yeah, that is all of that. I am just gonna go take off my makeup now, so. I'll talk to you guys probably in the morning tomorrow when morning, I get guys. up. guys, it is Friday, the day after Thanksgiving, Black Friday shopping. I'm not really doing that much Black Friday shopping, but we're at Big Lots. We're looking for a Christmas tree, but like we're not having any luck. So, uh, yeah. So, I'll just show you guys what they have here because they have some cute stuff. Cue the music because um, the music here is really loud. cleaning out my room and just organizing stuff we did a little bit like trying to find a christmas tree and we didn't find one so now i'm just like i'm up i need to be productive today it's only 8 30 a.m i love getting up early like i got up at like six today i used to be like a 5 a.m gym girly and i need to get back on that but we are cleaning out all of my makeup drawers i want to get rid of everything that's old in here so i figured i'd just kind of do like a little time lapse and show you guys what i'm getting rid of so i have my garbage here that we're just gonna start throwing stuff out that's old and just get rid of the stuff that i don't use anymore so we got the christmas music pumping and let's get cleaning Some 
lighting but we're going through all the makeup eyeshadow palettes and you guys I have my original Carly Bible palettes that I just cannot get rid of like I have to hold on to them because they're like I know I don't use them but like they're just like a national treasure to me so I'm not getting rid of them uh the one palette that I have that I absolutely like don't ever reach for is this James Charles Morphe palette I hate, absolutely like hate this so I'm throwing it out I don't ever use it I have my two Jaclyn Hill palettes that I you can see like very dirty because I use them so much the palette I have here is this is like from Amazon it's supposed to be like a Huda Beauty dupe I don't ever reach for this so I'm just gonna toss it garbage I have this old Maybelline lemonade craze collection I use this a lot um, so I think I'm just gonna keep this because sometimes I reach for it. Blurred Shadow, I usually keep this for like when Halloween rolls around. It's like the time that I grab for this palette, so I'll keep that. I have my Norvina palette, which I reach for a lot. My Soft Glam palette I use all the time. One of my favorites, and then my Modern Renaissance I still have because I've used this one like so much. Some of my favorites, so I'm gonna still keep these because I do use them. Two of the Natasha Denona palettes. This is in Peak and Anaya. These are like a warm and cool tone. I feel like this is like the best option for you to have. Um, I have my Double Entendre by ColourPop and Kylie Cosmetics. These two are my favorite. This is the like OG Kylie Cosmetics palette. Love this. So I'm just cleaning out all my shadows. My camera's flashing at me, so I need to go charge it. So I will see you guys when we do something. So I have finished cleaning up and organizing my room. I lighted one of those Santa Naturals candle in Fraser fur and I'm really excited to see how this like smells. Um, I also, let me move this over to the side so I don't like burn myself. I am organized most of my jewelry here. So I kind of just took like bracelets in this i like organized all of my little like earrings and stuff like that um these are new amazon earrings that i actually got like you guys most of my jewelry is from amazon a lot of this is amazon and shein over here these earrings in here are like princess polly i have all of these like random earrings these paperclip johnny depp inspired earrings are um from amazon all these like Gucci earrings, Amazon. I feel like my hoops that I use like a lot. So I kind of have both just silver and gold in here. And then these are like my bigger gold jewelry that I wear. And then on this side, I have one of my SD cards I found. Love that for me. I just have like all my random rings that I wear like on a daily basis in here. So like um, this little ring I got from TJ Maxx. I have my Cartier rings that I got off of Amazon. It's not focusing, but those are like my everyday rings. My Michael Kors watch over here. I have like a bunch of other rings and like jewelry in there. All my dossier perfumes lined up. I love the dossier perfume. Um, headbands and like head stuff is over here for like hair accessories. I have, I have to bring this downstairs. It's a chip bag. And then I have over here, it's a picture of me and the Jonas Brothers. It sits so beautifully. And then I just have like a little notebook here that I took out. And then one of my coworkers gave me this for my birthday. This smells like Nick Jonas. I'm never opening it because, oh, I'm not going to burn this candle ever, but it smells like a nice cologne smell. Um, So I wanted to show you guys more of my jewelry. So let me go show you because I feel like I don't show you guys my room that often. But so here's my other like jewelry display. I got this so long ago. I forgot where I got this from, but I just have it hanging here. It's um, below my little Maryland photo, but I have all of my jewelry here. So I have a lot. Actually, this is like nothing to what I used to have. I just have like a ton of different jewelry items up here. Um, I actually love these earrings. Like I forget what I have up here, but I just have like a ton of that. And then over here I have like just different um, bracelets and necklaces. You guys can see I have a lot of gold necklaces and stuff like that. These are like the St. Patrick's Day beads that I will wear out. So like a lot of this is just like stuff that I don't always grab for, but like I just have it in case I wanna wear like a different style earring or like, I don't know. So I just have that there. And like my other 
my other main jewelry pieces are the ones that are over there that I just showed you guys because those are the ones that I wear like the most organized my makeup drawers I threw out so much makeup guys so let me show you these are this is kind of still a mess we're still working on cleaning all this up but I have in here like my face stuff which I really really decluttered so this is down to like the bare necessity of what I have left my Estee Lauder Dior foundations primers moisturizers blush like cream products like this is all i have you guys like this is insane because this whole thing was full and i just like got rid of literally all the old stuff and then oops in this drawer i keep a lot of my lashes um i have like a ton of kiss lashes because kiss is always so kind and sends me over really beautiful pr packages so i love those and then in here i have like brows and liner mascara and like utensils that i use and then in this one is just kind of like a bunch of random stuff i have a lot of notebooks in here this fan that was at my grandma's and it's like all of like little like places i think in sicily these are all but it doesn't say but it's a really pretty fan so i have that in there there's like glitter stuff i have my birthday pin from disney i kind of try to organize that's kind of like a drunk drawer but it is what it is this in here i have like other stuff my insta camera just random kind of random stuff in these drawers because i don't know where to put them and then again uh more random stuff i have like my microphone some books down there and then in this drawer i have again i really cut out a lot of stuff in here too so this was like all face stuff like blushes bronzers highlights and powders so i'm really down to like the necessity things that i use which i use on a daily basis so i've really got rid of a lot of stuff you guys and the one that's the most shocking to me is probably my lip drawer so this has gone down to like literally nothing because i had so many different like, lip stuff that i didn't even use anymore i got rid of all of my kylie cosmetic lipsticks because i absolutely hate the liquid lipsticks anyways but i had so many old ones they weren't good anymore so i just have a few in here that i like saved all my lip liners and then i have a few mac lipsticks that i don't use anymore but i don't want to get rid of them these are like the viva glam gaga collection and that was like back in 2012 i think they're very old i never reached for those i just don't want to get rid of them because i just loved those um lipsticks and then in here i have some eyeshadow palettes and stuff like that this are just all the ones that i have now um i just feel like i tried to get rid of as many as i could one is like a bunch of sunglasses um cleaning rags for the glasses just basically all sunglasses and then this bottom one is like more <laughs> more jewelry that i don't always wear um but i have in here like i have stuff that hasn't even been opened like i have this necklace from disney that's not even open i have like a ton of stuff in here and then just like random random items yeah, i know like i get a lot of questions a lot that you guys want me to oops am i zoomed in you guys want me to show my room a little bit my room really isn't that big but i figured i'd just show you guys like a little bit um and then like on the side is like my bed and yeah so that's kind of that i'm going to probably i think i might end this vlog and start a new one um i've been liking to do the weekly vlog so stay tuned for more weekly vlogs i'll probably start one tomorrow but i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want to see more videos like this give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i post videos two times a week here on my channel thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye